Hey everybody, Prince here. This is going to be another video, but yes, this is going to be a super, super short video. This is basically going to be my viewer's choice question sort of video. I'm not sure what I want to call it. I guess you want to call it Prince's viewer's choice question, whatever the fuck, you know. <laughs> um, so as we all know, next month is going to be the 2021 Money in the Bank pay-per-view from WWE. And it kind of got me thinking, you know. You know, the Money in the Bank, you know, concept has been pretty poorly handled the last few years. There's been a couple of decent choices and decent booking ideas, but for the most part, the booking of the Money in the Bank has been pretty dreadful in various different areas. I don't really need to go over them right now. So this left me asking the question, should WWE continue with Money in the Bank and uh, try to find ways to improve it, or should they just get rid of the concept altogether? I mean... Obviously, they're not going to do that since they do have the pay-per-view around the corner. But then this lead me, led me to another question, to another follow-up question. So I remember uh, Sanders Robin Twenty Four did a video uh, two years ago, uh, heading into the Stomping Grounds Twenty Nineteen pay-per-view, where he said the question, where he said that WWE should bring back King of the Ring as a pay-per-view. And while obviously it didn't turn out to be a pay-per-view, they did bring back the King of the Ring tournament later that late summer, early fall, and it ended up being a mostly successful tournament, especially that final between Chad Gable and, and Baron Corbin, which was surprisingly great. So, and I definitely agree with them that it would be great for the company to bring the, the pay-per-view back as like, like the tournament back as like a pay-per-view, you know, that summertime pay-per-view, you know, a couple months after WrestleMania and then a couple months before uh, SummerSlam, because obviously the summertime usually is the most exciting period of the year because people are not in school and uh, they're at home, you know, you know, chilling and everything. So the summertime after WrestleMania, you know, after the WrestleMania period, uh, usually is their hottest period of the year. So that leaves the question, the true, true question of, would you rather see WWE continue uh, Money in the Bank, or would you rather them get rid of Money in the Bank and replace it with King of the Ring? Or do you have alternative options or you know suggestions of what the WWE could do in the future? I'm not going to get my answer right now. I'll wait until you guys uh, give some good responses. I'm not sure how many responses I'll get from this video, but... Uh, if this turns out well, maybe I'll do more of these. I'm not suggesting that I'm going to do these weekly or anything. This will just pop up whenever, um, whenever there's an interesting subject or a topic to talk about. So I'm just going to leave this video up on the channel for the next couple of weeks. And if I get a good response from this, maybe I'll do a response video to this video in the future. So let me know. What do you guys think? Money in the bank or king of the ring? Let me know in the comment section below. I would love to read your responses and hopefully uh, respond to them in the future. So until that video or whatever next video I got coming up next, guys. Peace.